Hello everybody, my name is Sneha and welcome back to my channel and uh, I will be doing and swatching liquid lipsticks. Oh hell yes. So of course I don't know how to shoot this video because I was totally messing it up and I did shoot a video for reviewing this product and uh, I can totally see where I am lacking and uh, apart from reviewing products because see I'm not a like talented one in terms of reviewing products so it's a bit of a mess so please 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 if you watch my earlier videos and if you find any problems let me know I will learn of course I will learn from you that's all so apart from that why there is cat here I don't even have a cat right now anyway so i have like seven of those of color liquid lipsticks and these are all my favorite shades oh my god these are like shades from me only because i don't wear uh, neutral shades a lot and these are all kind of bright on the face kind of shades so let's get it started so definitely i will be using a wipe like that it's a towelette um, and uh, I have micellar water to remove that. I also have this Bioderma one which I am about to finish it up. So I will use that again. And for moisturizing I have Borolin. Everybody knows that Borolin. And I have also one more product. This is the Micellin My Sweet Lip Balm. So I am also finishing it. Uh, I am a snake. I am a Slytherin. God. I wish I can be Slytherin. Oh my god. Sorry, fan fangirling moment. So this is the lip balm. I am almost finished it and I really really love this lip balm. Oh I wish it is available in India, but um it just I have not used that Laneige uh, lip balm or mask, but I think this thing is like bomb.com i think it is more amazing like it is amazing 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 than even boring so enough talking about the lip balm this is uh, this available in dubai so i got it from a kind of pop-up store in dubai mall ibn Battuta mall and i really love this product anyway so i will be like reviewing uh, not reviewing because you already know what it looks um like what I'm saying? Oh my god, I'm such a shitty person in terms of the game. Please, 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 please. Sorry. <laughs> so, let me talk about the formula first. Okay. Okay, I'm so, so, so bad at this. I'm so sorry. Very good. And my mascara is melting. Oh my god. Color bar. You better set it waterproof and it's melting. And I'm sweating. Such an amazing, amazing thing. So, first of all, the formula. The formula is kind of not like um, liquidy, like Huda Beauty one. If any of you have used or the Lakme, the new uh, Forever Matte, I guess they have launched. Not again like that. It's not liquidy at all. It's more like a gloopy. It's more kind of a mushy texture. Or you can say even creamy. But I have three shades which are a little bit old. So, uh, they are kind of, the texture has got a bit thick but definitely the formula is still good i can still wear them there is nothing problem in the uh, like comfort thing and these are quite comfortable this does not dry out my lips but even though you should wear a good lip balm or even exfoliate before using any kind of liquid lipsticks so i have seven shades and uh, one of them is from i think disney collection so this is the disney connection color Again, I can't speak. I'm a snake. I'm third. Oh, I remember there is a meme with a cat. The cat is crawling. And uh, the person, I think the owner, tell you, oh, you were a snack. <laughs> it was totally funny. Oh, God. I don't know if you could remember that. Uh, so, this is the shade Irreplaceable. Quite a handful in. So, I'll be giving you hand swatches and obviously swatches on me and i am in c40 to nc42 right now i'm in c40 and i'm sweating please ignore that 
and of course my uh, my face is like bare face I don't have a makeup like base makeup on my face you can see this is me and the video I am shooting under natural light uh, I'm so professional <laughs> so let I already to told you about the like texture let's talk about the wand so this is the toe foot applicator uh, it's similar to wet and wild do foot applicator uh, the cat suits one so it smell nothing like too distinctive nothing vanilla nothing caramel the smell is good not overpowering but I guess I don't know what type of I think it's a candy like of smell that's it so First, I will start with the, my one of my favorite shade here. Uh, where is there? Where is there? So this is the shade Los Angeles, and this is one of my old lipstick. And this is how that look. Those of colors, and the name is mentioned here. You can't see, of course. So this is the shade Los Angeles, and uh, this have bit dry down, but still the formula looks. So it's a kind of uh, pinky, peachy sort of sort of shade. Like it have more kind of peach and red undertone. It's more of a warm lip, liquid lipstick, and I really like it. So I will be giving you a swatch. And as I told you, I am in C40 uh, Maybelline Superstay Golden. I guess yeah, golden. So you can get idea. Okay. So this is the liquid lipstick I'm wearing. I don't using any lip liner because I'm lazy and I don't have a lip liner, matching lip liner with this. So I'll be using this and try to apply it. Oh, I just love this color. So as you can see it's a kind of warm peach reddish kind of a liquid lipstick uh, I mean the color and it does look like this I will give you a zoom yes look into my face pumpkin face oh god I'm sweating so much even it's raining out here it's pouring but there is not even one ounce of thunder so this is the color Los Angeles. It's a pretty beautiful shade. You can, if you don't want like to the face of kind of a shade, you can definitely wear it. It will um, literally suit every skin tone. But if you are a dusky beauty, rich melanin chocolate beauty out there, then I will suggest you to wear a lip liner. Otherwise, it will look too more, uh, too much neon. On you so yeah it's definitely a pretty shade it does have that chipku wala feeling but it's not like disgusting or anything and this liquid lipstick does stay for um, five to six hours and uh, even if you eat or drink then it will literally fade it out from your inner part of it so yeah it definitely works as a normal liquid lipstick but it's comfortable it's not at all trying so i really like it i don't uh, prefer the what should i say i will not say it is like totally comfortable like the uh, smashbox or the flower beauty ones but i really like it it's in the medium range so and oh by the way it costs 1500 rupees uh, according to the INR value, like the Indian price value, uh, I think it's more like $12 or $15. Mm -hmm. I, I'm not sure what price is that. I think it's more than that. Okay, so I think I got it in a discount. So that's why it's 1500 rupees, but it's thing, I think $16 or $15 mark. So yeah, this is the shade Los Angeles. This is the shade Extra Spicy. 
and this is the hand swatch it's a bright red kind of shade and it's just like this I zoom zoom yes I did missed up a little bit here but work on that it's pretty red not like um, it's have more blue undertone I guess on neutral I'm very bad at mentioning tones but I will try my best uh, on me it does look a bit of blue undertone and uh, this is the shade and it does literally brighten me up my face in a good way so this is the shade extra spice it's definitely putting more cool here so yeah this is the shade Betty me by the way the uh, previous shade I mentioned is extra saucy not extra spicy uh, do I have cat hair again? I don't know, I can have that here. So this is the shade Berry B. It's a very plummy berry kind of a shade, of course, as per the name. Uh, I really like it. It's like a very uh, suitable for our type of skin tone, like Indian skin tone, Asian skin tone. Um, it's a definitely fall shade. Like if you are uh, like berry tones, um, then I think it would really really um, like it um, it's more into the uh, by the way I have sheared it because I can make it more dark but I think I like the sheer one much more and uh, you can definitely layer it up but you need to uh, like try the first layer then you can layer it up mm, yeah this is the shade and this is the close up it's a very pretty shade. So this is the shade Irreplaceable. Hope I am pronouncing it right. Yeah, Irreplaceable. Okay, that's a mouthful. So this is a Disney collection and this is the uh, orangey red. So it's pull it's pulling more orange on me and I definitely like this shade. Oh my god. Uh, it's really pretty shade so I will zoom you this is like a very beautiful uh, on the face kind of a shade uh, of course like it's definitely a like a statement shade I, I, I think so this is the shade irreplaceable So this is the shade Strawberry Pop and it's a, I think, dupe for one of a Jeffree Star Strawberry shade. I think that is from Summer Collection, maybe. But anyway, this is a coral pinky kind of shade. Totally my kind of shade. I really, really love this kind of bright coral pink shades. And so this is the swatch. Uh, I will definitely say it's a bit patchy than the other shades I have applied previously. I really need to finish it up and although I will not be complaining because this type of shades are very difficult to make I guess and most of my uh, this type of shades need a bit of more uh, like work. So I don't mind it at all, but yeah, definitely you can see the shade is like, it's very bright shade. I really love it. It's just like, it's not like too bright, like the irreplaceable shade that I uh, used earlier, the, I guess the orange one, but it definitely pulls some string. It's like mellow, yet like, oh, you are thinking me as a mellow, but I'm not that. Well, I said too much. I'm sorry. So I will give you a zoom, zoom, zoom. And this is the shade my Strawberry Pop. By the way, did I mention that Dose of Colors is a vegan brand and I think it's a cruelty free brand as well. So, yeah. This is the shade Strawberry Pop. So, this is the shade Berry Me 2. And this is how it looks. And this is the hand swatch. Honestly, I really really love this color and I think um, 
in Indian market you will find similar uh, kind of shade um, I was really looking for a dupe actually I really don't want to get this because 1500 rupees it was expensive but um, looking for that exact two was really annoying because somewhat you were not even that uh, like satiated you would you will never feel that satisfaction uh, like I have literally uh, I was literally looking for the two for relentlessly red from MAC retromatic uh, bullet lipstick and I had so many similar shades but it was never like the relentlessly red and I still have not found uh, exacto i do have similar shades but it's not like exacto so i thought like i don't want it to spend on like five six lipstick of a similar kind of shade it's better to get the exact one so uh, that's my excuse for getting this and um i will not say that i'm really really happy with the formula of this one because it's patchy it's really patchy right now if I zoom you up, you will definitely never even found find that it, there is any patchy or anything. But trust me, sisters and brothers, if you wanted to buy this liquid lipstick, I think you can skip. Uh, I am not sure if it's only for me, but it's a bit patchy because when I used to apply this, there the whole portion in this middle of the portion was really missing. So. I had to uh, let it dry for a few seconds then I applied it again so I obviously the uh, like see my fingers are even soft so I was tennising it with my fingers so even uh, I will say that if you uh, are still want to get this so you have to work with the lip liner if you have a similar shade work with the lip liner then use it i think that will be a better chance uh it will not make a patchy kind of a thing uh definitely beautiful fuchsia baritone shade um it's a berry me too so that's a kind of up version maybe and uh, this is the berry me and this is the berry me too so berry me is more kind of uh, like muted more kind of a muted shade and Betty Me Too is like oh I'm here look at me but still I don't like the formula of this particular one but I love the color oh my god uh, I think Wet n Wild Fuchsia is a very similar shade like a very similar shade and uh, if I use that with a deep purple lip liner I think that will look exactly but anyway I don't mind of getting this one because it's a really pretty shade Hmm. So this is the Berry Me Too. Hope you like it. And the last shade is remaining. Just, just the last one. I'm so happy. By the way, I wanted to mention one thing. This Berry Me Too shade actually have stained my lips. So yeah, this is the aftermath of six lipsticks. Oh my god. But anyway, the Berry Me Too have stained my lips quite a lot. And I'm using this Garnier Micellar Water by the way and it definitely very good for removing all my liquid lipsticks that I'm wearing. So anyway, that's a, just a quick disclaimer. So this is the shade Merlot or Merlot. I think it's pronounced as Merlot. So this is the shade. It's, it's deeper, I think. Yeah, it's deeper than... Uh, strawberry pop obviously it's ripper than strawberry pop but it's different than the extra saucy that I have it is more of a pinky red shade and I, I love this shade oh my god I think I have a dupe of this not exact one but I think I have one uh, I think I will do a dupe video yeah will be really helpful for uh, the Indian consumers out here who cannot afford a uh, dose of colors because obviously dose of colors is not available in India uh, but if it is even available in India it's expensive <laughs> but seriously oh my god this is such a pretty color so this is the shade Merlot it's 
just like totally cool tone pinky red color like I live for this type of colors <laughs> and it's like surprisingly all the like all the shades brightening up my face so this is the shade Marlo so anyway I definitely enjoy shooting this video for you all guys it's really tiring man really tiring but I really love doing this and uh, it was like a kind of um, what should I say that adrenaline rush okay let's do a video so I know there are not many beauties out there who have uh, Indian beauties out there who have uh, swatched I think Antariksha I think I'm pronouncing her name correct she may have swatched I'm not sure though uh, she stays in Singapore uh, she's a really good a famous youtuber good youtuber and I really like her swatch she is obviously deeper than me like she is uh, NCE 43 I think um, but definitely also check out her videos I will mention her name uh, YouTube name so you can totally check her out videos her videos are amazing so anyway I don't know why am I promoting other beauties but it's very necessary to promote other beauties who are really underrated so this is already a very long video I'm really very sorry for that again but hope this lip swatches help you I am NC40 I am NC40 to NC42 so these are the perfect festive shades that you can enjoy and even uh, like these are not at all like oh I am mellow no 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 these are like on the point like on your face statement colors bold colors so this is totally a festive shades and uh, hope you like the swatches and the review part uh, yeah that's all from my side hope you like the video hope it be helpful for you guys and if it be helpful then please watch my other videos I do have swatched other videos other lipstick swatches as well till then ta -da! bye bye and my hands are totally stained Yes, this one's stained. Yeah. Bye-bye.